Yeah. Ah, this okay. is this week old. Yes. Okay, sorry. Um, <laughs> yeah, so, so one of the things you have to remember with a cold ring is what is missing. Keep that in mind. What is missing in this? Because some of the things are missing is the father never mentioned that her name's mentioned. He's never mentioned her name. We don't know anything other than dad combs his hair. Okay, he's doing good. He's not in a wheelchair and he's combing his hair and his eyes are back or something. Okay, next. And he did wear Old Spice in this world. All I keep smelling is Old Spice. He wore something. Because I smell your father in the same way I'm connecting with your loved ones in the same way I'm connecting to you. So all of a sudden you start smelling things. You need to cologne or aftershave. And you know that, that that's his way of acknowledging that he is there and he's with you. He's also talking about the dogs that have passed as well. He has dogs that are with him. And there's a German shepherd? Uh, it was, yeah. They were, they were him. Perfect, perfect. He says his dogs are here. Your, your dad got more excited that he's not more excited to make it into heaven. He's more excited that the dogs are here. My dogs are here. He's so excited about that. Do you understand that? So, so now, so know that those two souls are on the other side of your dad's, your dad's way of not acknowledging that they're there. Okay. All right. So there's a lot to unpack in this. What did I see? Dogs have souls. <laughs> yeah. Who knew? All dogs are in heaven. We all want to think our pets are in heaven, right? Oh yeah, pets. We, 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 all, we want to connect your pets. All right, go with the Old Spice. How many people in this room do not have a connection to Old Spice from somebody in their family? <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, I, and, and I checked on using Wikipedia, so you know it could be biased. But Wikipedia says it's one of the top spies, the sins, uh, especially for somebody who has a person who's probably 60, 70, 80, 90 year old grandchildren. Yeah, I spy, I was spice what you get. My dad connected to Old Spice. But look at what it says. She didn't say it was Old Spice. What did she say? He it was something. Well, yeah, he probably did wear something. He's combing his hair now and he's got something on him. The other thing that I didn't pick up on until later was this thing about the German shepherds. Does, does the psychic say that the father had a German shepherd? No, what was no, no. no. He asked the question. What was what was he says, the what was shepherd? the German shepherd? Now, again, how many people in this room have never owned a dog or had a dog in the family? Two, three? Okay. But you've been around dogs. <laughs> right? So you probably have been in people's households that had dogs. Yeah, so so the so the thing that the guy had a connection to a dog or dogs is extremely likely. The other thing about the German shepherds is she never the psychic never does say, you have German shepherds. No, he's just talking about that. He says, what about the German shepherds? So what could that mean? They could mean they belong to the next door neighbor. It could be some the dogs are still alive. It could be the dogs scared the kids. There's German shepherds that scared somebody whenever they walked by in a fence. It could be any, many of things. The other thing I looked up is German shepherds, believe it or not, are the third most popular dog to own. Until a certain period of time when they became unpopular, which was World War II, and they became unpopular again, and then in the 1960s, they became again one of the most popular dog breeds. I didn't know that. That's your opinion, again. So, um, so again, it's ambiguous. Dad is saying the dogs are running around and he's so happy about the dogs being there. Thanks, Dad. Why didn't you tell us who's going to win the presidential election or where the PP tapes are or something? Else? It's not getting into politics. But my point is, Dad could say so much more than this. This is like whatever. Okay, one more slide. Yeah, what's the winning lottery with his dad? He says, I want to, I want her to know that, I, that I'm the one watching over her, over you, and I'm the one that is there because you feel a presence in the house, and you feel a soul is there, and, you, and you're like, oh, who the hell is this? He goes, no, that, that's me. I'm the one that's haunting you. I'm the one that's in the house. Everybody says my house is haunted. It's your father. <laughs> <laughs> that's a nice one. <laughs> I know it's his way of bringing the, uh, that through because I, I, I want you to know that, that I'm okay and I'm important like, by, and more importantly by me, correctly uh, thought that me and I'm still your father on the other side and I still watch over you every day. So, I, so know that, that you, you sense me 
it's okay to talk to me. He says, because I'm, I'm right there by your side, know that the dogs are here and they are safe and at peace with me because they, they were like his kids when I'm connecting with him and you are going to know that this, that this goes for us. All, 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 the, all that when we lose animals here in the physical world, you know, they go back with our loved ones on the other side. You, know, you should see my freaking, <laughs> it looks like rippling brothers and Barnum. Uh, all these souls are, are, are with them. And it's his way of bringing that uh, through and, and letting you know that, that he's okay. He's safe and at peace and that, and that he's here and that he is with you. What do you guys think? Talking so fast, how is he hearing these messages from the Father? <laughs> he has no time to hear anything. It's happening so fast, and they're all talking to him at once. So, so my point is, is when you hear about people who go to psychics and so on, I bet you the character, the, the female character that Nina's playing, is going to leave this place and go home and tell her people how she went to see a psychic. And the psychic knew all about the dogs and her dad. And probably she's even going to re remember that he named her dad and the names of the dogs. I wouldn't be surprised if he said that, yeah. She fills in all the blanks because she's human. She wants to tell a good story. She doesn't want people to go, oh, you idiot. You just paid how much money to go see this guy? She wants to be able to say, I saw the most amazing psychic today. And he was spot on. He was so awesome. He knew my dad. He knew the dogs and the names. And he knew all about my dad's personality. There's no way in the world the psychic could have known these things about my dad. But right? is, is this comforting paragraph, the closing paragraph, how he punches her? Yeah, so that is a big comfort, as you just saying. That's a comforting thing that could apply to pretty much anybody. It's just, and you'll see a lot of this with the psychics that are cold with him. So I want to make sure that you guys are forewarned as you leave today, later, after everybody's done, and after uh, Chipotle, you will, you will have this to take back with you, to remember that these people who are, are experiencing this are not stupid, they're not ignorant, they're not gullible, they, well, maybe there's a couple, but <laughs> what's happening is that they are, they're bought into something, we don't educate people into critical thinking until what, college, I think is when we start taking critical thinking classes. And so we're not really training people to understand this. And it happens so fast. This whole exchange is four minutes long when you, you, when you actually get it. So I do have written all about this article and more on the website I gave you guys earlier about time.project.org. Uh, and you'll see this whole article explaining this in detail is the is called Matt Frazier Live. And the reason why I call it Matt Frazier Live is because he has a video called Matt Frazier Live. And I want him and I want people to Google and get my article instead of his video. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Peter? Uh, so uh, on the bright side of this. Oh wait, is it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Alright. Um, oh and thank you, thank you to my victims. Yeah.